Growing up with a sibling by your side can be amazing, except when it isn't. Some of these famous sisters have star power, but it took them some time to learn how to get along. Solange and Beyonce's relationship benefited from therapy, while Kourtney Kardashian's time with a counselor highlighted her issues with Kim. Northwest and Saint West there was a time when Northwest desperately wanted another sibling, and that was before she actually had one. Despite her initial enthusiasm for being a big sister, she quickly realized Saint wasn't quite what she expected. I thought it was a phase. She does not like her brother. Apparently, North realized how sweet being an only child can be and wasn't happy about having to share her parents, Kim Kardashian and Kanye West, with anyone else. According to Kim, her son Saint is, well, a saint, but wasn't enough for North to even consider letting him in her room at least for a few years. When Chicago was born, North flat out pretended Saint didn't exist. It took a while, but North has finally accepted that she's well past being an only sibling at this point. It took until January of 2020 for Kim to announce that her two oldest kids, North and Saint, finally get along now. Charlie D'Amelio and Dixie D'Amelio Charlie D'Amelio and her sister Dixie look so much alike that they're frequently mistaken for twins. They even got invited to the epic twin Zoom party by the Dolan twins who, as you probably know, are actual twins. In reality, Dixie is older than Charlie and isn't interested in following in her little sister's footsteps. She may not have her sister's insane number of TikTok followers or her dance moves, but Dixie says she has her own strengths that make her a star. She's been interested in singing and acting for a long time and believes these skills set her apart from her sibling. Although the two sometimes collaborate on videos, they can't help but argue in front of the camera too. These two may have joined and then left the Hype House together, but they're working to create two different brands, showcasing their individual strengths. Dakota Fanning and Elle Fanning Dakota Fanning is a well-known child star, and her sister Elle got her start playing the younger version of her in projects like I Am Sam and the Taken miniseries. But growing up in her sister's shadow wasn't easy, and when Dakota got a part in Friends and Elle didn't, she refused to watch it in protest. But it wasn't just their competing careers that kept them apart. According to Dakota, they just didn't have a lot in common when they were growing up. You know, other than their looks. When Dakota was 13 and Elle was 9, they simply weren't sure what to make of each other. But as they grew older, the age gap between them became less prominent and they became closer. But that doesn't mean you'll see them as co-stars anytime soon. While Elle and Dakota aren't opposed to working together, Elle says they don't want to portray sisters on the big screen and that's all people want to cast them as. Kendall and Kylie Jenner we all know there's a lot of fighting in the Kardashian-Jenner family, but there's definitely a lot of love, too. Kendall and Kylie may be close in age, but when it comes to their personalities, they couldn't be more different. Guys always favor Kendall and it's so annoying! While Kylie has made running a makeup empire look easy, she admits she could never be a supermodel like her sister Kendall. In fact, she's admitted that if she and Kendall weren't related, they probably wouldn't be friends. But since they are, they tend to stick together. Or at least they try to. One particular sisterly disagreement happened when Kylie skipped a family trip that Kendall had flown in from London to attend. I actually can't believe that Kylie's leaving right now. Even though Kylie ended up apologizing and saying her absence was the result of stormy schedule, it's clear there are quite a few differences between these famous siblings. Aaron Carter and Nick Carter The issues between Nick Carter and his younger brother Aaron go way beyond a simple personality clash. Aaron has publicly struggled with mental health issues, physical health issues, and an eating disorder, and claims that some of his problems can be traced right back to Nick. Things got painfully public when Nick and his sister Angel filed a restraining order against Aaron and his alarming behavior. Nick tweeted that he wished the best for his brother, but had to stay away for the safety of himself and his family. Aaron furiously replied that he hadn't seen his brother in four years and intended to keep it that way. He declared them done for life and implied that the general public has no idea what Nick is really capable of. The Jonas Brothers 
Saying that fans were upset when the Jonas Brothers disbanded might be the understatement of the century. Come on, the Hanson Brothers are still going strong and Mbop came out in 1996. But Kevin, Joe, and Nick learned that working with your family isn't always easy, especially when you're all different people and you can't escape from each other. Because we were forced to be together because we were working together. Over time, a friction developed between the three of them and they just couldn't get along anymore. But don't despair, Jonas Brothers fans, because this story has a happy ending. Being able to take time apart instead of being forced together helped them gain perspective and come to appreciate each other. They developed their own strengths. Kevin manages the business side, Nick is all about music, and Joe loves entertainment. These three ultimately learned how to work together better than ever before, and we're glad they could reunite because they wanted to and not because they had to. Beyonce and Solange Beyonce and Solange are two of the most famous people on the planet, so it's crazy to imagine there was a time when they didn't get along. But growing up together wasn't easy, especially when Destiny's child member Kelly Rowland moved in. She joined the Knowles household when Solange was five, and since Beyonce had her bestie on hand all the time, Solange started to feel left out. But Tina Knowles wanted the kids to get along, so she insisted they go to some therapy sessions. She said they taught Beyonce how to be more sensitive to Solange and helped her be protective of her little sister. And it seems like Tina was right, since Solange says her big sis Beyonce would help protect her from bullies when they were growing up. As adults, these two sisters are super close and supportive of each other's careers. Ashley Simpson and Jessica Simpson According to Ashley Simpson, the rumors of her feud with Jessica have been way overblown. There were even allegations that Ashley's song Shadow was about her older sister and how she felt growing up with a famous sibling. But Ashley says it's more about dealing with herself and the pressure she put on her own career. Still, these two were definitely different growing up. Ashley says she was always closer to their mother, while Jessica was more of a daddy's girl. There have been rumors about them fighting throughout the years, but it's clear these two are close. Despite their differences, Ashley and Jessica are proud of each other, and their kids are best friends. Prince William and Prince Harry all royal family fans know Prince William and Prince Harry have totally different personalities and career paths. The Duke of Cambridge is getting ready to ascend to the throne someday, while Harry is giving up the royal way of life in favor of a quieter one with his wife Meghan Markle and their son Archie. Royal reporter Katie Nichol told Vanity Fair that there was tension between the two brothers ever since Harry started dating Meghan. Supposedly, he felt as though William wasn't doing enough to welcome her into the family while William had reservations about their relationship and didn't quite express them in the most empathetic way. All of this inspired the brothers to make a rare public statement about their relationship, during which Harry admitted, inevitably, stuff happens, and that their busy schedules keep them apart more often than not. But he also said that they love each other very much and remain huge supporters of one another. Kate and Pippa Middleton Kate Middleton and her sister Pippa have always seemed close, but growing up, they had a sibling rivalry going on. As kids, they were competitive with one another when it came to school, sports, and of course, social status. Despite this, they loved one another fiercely, and that didn't change when Kate married into the royal family. But Kate becoming a duchess definitely took its toll on Pippa, who wasn't used to the spotlight and called the attention embarrassing. Meanwhile, Pippa's actions occasionally caused a stir thanks to her connection to the royal family, like when she and a friend were caught with a supposed weapon in view of the paparazzi. Still, these siblings remain close, and Kate says she wants her kids to have the same kind of upbringing that she did. Kim Kardashian and Kourtney Kardashian Family dynamics are hard to change, especially the longer they go on, so Kourtney got some outside assistance learning to set boundaries with her siblings. Kim reacted to this, well, if you watch Keeping Up With The Kardashians, you can probably guess. So don't even act like you know what I'm talking about. She wasn't crazy about the changes Kourtney was making, and Kourtney was struggling to find a happy medium between living her own life and being there for her family. While discussing Kylie being too sick to go to Paris, Kim declared that she and Chloe take their commitments seriously, unlike Courtney, who didn't appreciate being called out. She said Kim doesn't appreciate all the work she does, and that's when the two siblings crossed a serious line. Although these sisters have said they'll always love each other no matter what, it's clear they have a serious personality clash going on. Kim Richards and Kyle Richards 
If you've seen The Real Housewives of Beverly Hills, then you probably know all about the feud between sisters Kim and Kyle Richards. Kyle admits their relationship has had its ups and downs, but accused fellow cast member Brandi Glanville of turning Kim against her. She said Kim makes everything out to be her fault, and she was tired of being blamed for everything and treated like she was crazy. Kyle insisted Kim won't admit when she's wrong and instead finds fault with all of her actions. As for Kim's side of the story, well, get your pre-order in now because The Whole Truth, The Reality of It All is set to be released in February 2021. While promoting her memoirs, Kim said she's ready to let go of some serious secrets and Radar Online claims her sister Kyle is worried about what will be revealed when the book comes out. Do you think any of these stars are sibling goals despite their differences? Let us know which pair of celebrity siblings you find the most inspiring in the comment section below. And don't forget to click subscribe for more great videos from us here at The Taco. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you again next time.